That rapid motor sound you're hearing is an African wildcat purring. These are kittens, about four months old. They're wild and native to Africa and can easily be mistaken for domesticated house cats. In fact, when I first met them, I wondered why they had tabby cats locked in a cage. They even behave like a normal house cat. But they can bite extremely hard, man. Look at that age. They will play with me a little bit. Wow, that is sharp. That's absolutely like, like needles. You would thread, thread thread with. They played like house cats. <laughs> oh, she likes to get untied. They showed affection like house cats. And they meowed like house cats. They also piled on like house cats, laying on you. Awful cute, man. They get bigger than an average house cat, too. Check out my GoPro uh, chest harness. It's all accounted for. Every single one of them. They got a lot of heat generating. And they chatter like house cats. That's their reaction to seeing a bird land on the cage. And they're all doing it. It's quite bizarre. It's like they're calling to it. It's called chattering, and many domesticated cats do this, to include wild ones. Some think it's to mimic the prey they're hunting, to get them to come closer. They also need like a house cat. And when there's a scary predator around, they get defensive like a house cat. What are you looking at? A predator. Right there. It's an incredible display of stalking. You can barely see this cheetah move. This has to be the slowest cheetah on earth. I had to speed things up. The big bad cheetah's coming. Look at her. Notice the hairs on the wildcat rising. That's close enough. Time to split. Look at this. I'm taking on big cheetah. Got his hackles all up. He's scared. He's scaring these cats again. They all got their got their fur on. Look at him. He's backing off. It was six against one, but I don't know. I had to help this one down. Come here, it's okay now. He's gone. Big bad cat's gone. The only time they didn't behave like house cats was feeding time. That's when you saw the wild and the wild African cat. Yeah, it's feeding time for the African wild cats. This one, two. 
I sell six of them. Oh, I think we got the on the food, buddy. I don't got it. It's over there. Oh no, man. No, well, you can not put them down so I can put them over in the bed. Meow, 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 meow. Oh, look at him. My goodness. Uh, no, we haven't fed them like this before. Normally they get fed that side and we don't put yeah. them in. We leave them out when we feed them. Now, what are they eating today? It looks like uh, cat food. Cat pellets, yeah. It's just ordinary cat food for an extraordinary wildcat. If you like this video, please click the thumbs up. And check out these other two clips. I reunite with an old friend, and a cheetah cub and Jack Russell Terrier tough it out. Please consider joining my channel. Just click the subscribe button below.